Hi guys, got another build for you here. Um, this time we're continuing with the 1.5 leveling builds and I'm going to do a step by step one for the Sith Inquisitor Assassin. Um, so I'll put the points on and I'll give you some like direction of how to put the points on and then I'll give you some rotations and stuff that you can use with the build. Um, what you want to start off doing as soon as you get to level 10 um, you obviously be able to put your points on. The first two points you want to put on Thrashing Blades. Um, then you want to put your next three points on Charge Mastery. Um, then you want to put your next two points on Lightning Reflexes. Moving up, you want to put two points on Swelling Shadows. Um, then you want to put two points on lightning recovery um, moving up you want to pick up dark ward then energize and then two points on premonition um, and pick up disjunction over here as well then you want to put three points on blood of sif um, Stick two points on hollow. Then you want to pick up force pull. Um, then stick one, uh, sorry, pick up eye of the storm. And electrify. Then you want to move back down here and stick one point on electric execution. Which will open them up. Then you want to stick three points on Mountain Darkness. Um, then put your next two on Harness Darkness. And then finish the tree off the Darkness Tree with Wither. So you've got 31 points on the Darkness Tree. Now we're going to add some, um, add some skills from the Madness Tree. You want to... You want to stick three points on Exploitive Strikes. You want to stick two points on Sif Defiance. Um, then you want to put three points on Chain Shock. And finish the build off with two points on Torment. And there you have it. You have a level 50 build for the Sif Inquisitor. And the advanced class we're doing is Assassin. Now for some information on how to use the build. Um, depending what you're doing. Um, the recommended companion will be Talos as a healer, um, Andronicus as an RDPS, or Ashara as an MDPS. Um, for the ratings that you the you use until 50% will be defense, endurance, and willpower in that order. The charge you're using is dark charge, and for a rotation that you can use when you get to level 10 till level 19 your basic rotation will be discharge shock thrash then saber strike and you can use saber strike if you fall below 20 force as well and at 21 you'll get dark ward and your rotation will be dark ward discharge shock um, you can use that with energize um, thrash saber strike um, now that you've got dark ward you should focus on keeping that up at all times and then at level 40, you'll get your final talent point, and you you basically picked up a few skills from leveling as well. And your rotation will be Dark Ward, Wither, Discharge, Force Lightning, Assassinate, Shock, Thrash, Saber Strike. And as a good AOE rotation, you can use Wither, Discharge, Overload, and Lacerate. So give that one a go. I hope you're enjoying the builds. They're more step-by-step -step for you, so you know more of how to actually put the points on while you're, while you're leveling up. Got any questions, let me know. And um, let me know what other classes you want to see leveling builds for with the 1.5 patch. And I've also got a, um, a, a set of PvP builds as well on the way. Okay, guys, I'll leave it there. And uh, see you in the next vid. Cheers.